Now use hashtag trade to get your questions on the show live NFL Daily here. Mitchell Rands, Tom Downey. Now we're going to play some games. We're going to have some fun. So you guys are going to throw in your trade questions, but you got to use hashtag trade. And every single time that I misspeak, I'm going to put a idiot post and stamp on my forehead. So let's get right into the action. Polo zone. <laughs> Should the Bears on you. trade for Cam Newton? It's a good question. I like the idea of it but I don't think it's a mid-season trade. I think it makes more sense for Carolina and for Chicago to say, you know what, let's wait. A, for the Bears, you might as well see Trubisky for the rest of the year because you spent the second overall pick on him. You probably want to give him as much time as possible before you bail on it altogether. And then for the Panthers, you want to maximize your trade value. That comes in the offseason, especially if you can show Cam's healthy. Let's go to uh, Dalton Smith. Who should Saints trade for? I'll tell you what, Dalton. I, I'm sure you're subscribed, but if not, you know, make sure you are. Make sure you got notifications turned on. We'll have a Saints trade video coming out for you in the next couple of days. So make sure you're subbed, youtube.com slash chatsportstv if you need the link. But, you know, you're on YouTube, so just hit that big red button. Just do it. Subscribe, get those notifications turned on, and you'll know when that Saints video comes out. Dalton, can you do me a favor? Can everyone in the comment section tell Dalton what he needs to do, please? Thank you. Let's go to Caleb. Holtz, <laughs> who does Harrison want to see get traded and where? Assuming means Harrison Graham here. Harrison Graham, yeah. uh, I guess for the Chiefs? How about a defensive back? Literally anyone. <laughs> Chris Harris would be nice. I don't know if the Broncos are actually going to trade him. Patrick, Patrick Peterson, Peterson would be a dream. I don't know if he's actually available, but I, I think a defensive back, a corner. Maybe you call the Dolphins and see what the asking price here for Xavier Howard actually is. All right, let's go to Magic. Mm -hmm. I'm guessing you're a Magic fan? I don't know. Perhaps. Is Miami getting any trades? I don't think they make a trade. I think that they're at this point just selling. I mean, I think I think he needs trading for or trading away. So I'll answer it for that because they're not going to trade for anybody. Maybe they can get a team to bite on Kenyon Drake. I think that Kenyon Drake right now is available for just about anything. Maybe you can get Detroit to trade you a sixth or seventh round pick. But I don't think Drake has much, if any, trade value right now. Let's go to Douglas Dyer. Is there any O-line players Bears can trade for? Douglas, get uh, a picture. Look, you're missing the really right guard is a big issue with Long on IR. He hasn't been that good. You're looking for maybe a guard, I think, in particular. Top of my head... Not really. I you could thank you, Mitch. You can call the Bengals, but their offensive line. Like the issue is that the teams that are selling, right? Denver, the Bengals, the Dolphins. They don't have great offensive lines. I, you know, maybe you could work out a deal for Cowboys to have some depth. But does Adam Redmond move the needle? No, of course not. So I think for Chicago with limited draft capital, probably stuck. Sorry. Sorry. Let's go to Nico Demo Colon. Hashtag trade. Clone. Remember, you guys are using what? Nothing. You, uh, remember to use hashtag trade. Get your yeah. questions here on the show. Eagles trade one round, two round for Von Miller and Chris Harris. Man, you're really reading carefully so you don't put on the idiot sticker. Okay. Um, I don't think that's enough. I was going to say, I think it Denver. costs a lot more. Uh, I think that Chris Harris is probably worth the second round pick. That seems like pretty pretty good value, maybe a third at worst, but... That would only make it a first round. Prince pick of for Darkness goes laugh out loud. Eagles wish with yeah. you. Eagles do wish. I don't think Denver does that deal. Now we've been seeing a lot of questions coming in from Justin, and I appreciate your question, Justin. So get a picture. So I've heard some rumors lately that my Bills are looking for some wide receiver help before the deadline. Any options out there that would fit the McDermott culture? I do not believe he's actually available, but I think AJ Green fits that culture pretty well. I think, uh, I, I think, think A.J. Green fits any culture. Exactly. That's why I threw him out there. Because where does A.J. Green not fit? He fits everywhere. So I, I like the idea of A.J. I think he'd be a good fit. I think Allen could use some bigger targets. I just don't really think he's on the market. I don't either. But just, A.J. Green looks a lot like Justin Fousey. Justin, I don't know if I said it, but uh, get a picture. Now, I hate commercials, and I can't imagine anybody out there likes any commercials whatsoever. So eliminate commercials forever, all right? It's 100% free. Go to chatsports.com slash mytv. You got to hook up, connect to Wi-Fi, and while you're watching a football game, let me know what games you guys plan on watching this week. But if you're watching a game and it goes to commercial, mytv kind of just like takes over, and you can watch awesome content from Chatsports and other 
providers, but you got to go to chatsports.com slash mytv. It's 100% free. And it gets you back to the game before it starts, so you're fine there, too. Cherry on top. Or I should have said pickle. You had it. You had it. It was right there for you, bitch. I know. Yeah. Mr. Pickleberry on Could've top. Could have gone with, with, with a berry on top. No, we went with cherry instead. Well, should the Browns really be looking at trading for Nate Soldier? I, I don't hate the idea of it, just because I think the Browns could use some more offensive line help. It depends on what they give up. Are the Browns still in win-now mode? Yes. Well, you are in protecting your franchise quarterback mode. Okay. So that's fine. I don't think Nate Solder is the answer, though. I'd much rather have Trent Williams, even if it's more expensive. Solder's not that good, and he's kind of overpaid, too. Let's go to maybe one of the greatest names I've ever seen. Swampasaurus318. This could be okay. your burner account, for all I know. Does Teddy Bridgewater, yep, it's definitely Tom, <laughs> does Teddy Bridgewater have a major contract coming his way? If so, will it be the Saints or another team? Great question. I think the Saints are going to do everything they can to keep yeah, Teddy Bridgewater. Remember, the Dolphins allegedly offered more money for him, and Teddy's like, no, you guys suck. I'm going to stay in New Orleans. And it's worked out wonderfully for Bridgewater, who, by the way, is still only 26 years old. Can I just remind everybody of that? He's still very is Teddy young. Bridgewater He's older younger or than younger Brandon than, was. Is, is Teddy Bridgewater older or younger than Tom? Throw it in the comments. This, this is a good one because it's 15 days. It's all we're separated by. Fun fact. Really? Yeah. That's Interesting. It. So we'll come back to that in a second. But I, I, I think the Saints definitely Offer Soko him a significant amount of money, here. assuming Drew Brees retires. If Drew Brees doesn't retire, things get really complicated, but they desperately want to keep him, but someone's going to pay him. Seeing a lot of youngers there. Okay, I'm about it. Let's go to... He's, oh, he's, he is born just 15 days before me. Let's go to Supreme Entertainment, who has a below-average picture. Are the Lions going to trade for a running back? And who? It's a good question, so carry on Johnson. He's down. R.I.P. Uh, C.J. Anderson, they team. let go of. If there's a running back out there right now, or any coming to your mind, what do you, what do you think? I think personally they're just going to sign someone. I, well, they kind of uh, already They have. did, but you know, by more of a long-term option. Yep. I, Kenyon Drake makes sense for me. Amir Abdullah. <laughs> Too late for that one. <laughs> if if we want to get weird with it. Oh, I'm all about getting weird. How about Melvin Gordon? Yo. <laughs> just throwing it out there. Hey. How, how about Gordon? Or trade for Cam Newton and make him a running back. No, but, but this has always been the <laughs> knock on, on K Karrion Johnson, or at least it was my knock. I loved him coming out, but I docked him. He was always hurt at Auburn. Now he's always been hurt in the NFL. All right, I need you guys to do me a big favor here, okay? I need you to type TD in the comment section below. I want to do a live coverage of the NFL trade deadline, all right? So type yeah. TD my initials in the, in the comment section. Please do it. Type TD if you want Tom and I to be live on YouTube.com slash TV. Make sure you guys are subscribed. But if you want live coverage of the trade deadline, I need you to type TD. So, oh boy. Yeah, there we go. Show me those TDs. I don't know. We, we need more. The somebody, bosses, bosses somebody just say, threw an FAB. Bosses yes. say not enough yet. Let's see if we can get Tom to say this. Hey, type TD if you think I'm the best. Ooh, look at that, Mitch. They're everywhere. <sighs> can, I break, just, can, can I just get Tom to say that? What? Can you just say the lower third for me? Oh, show me those t TDs. Yeah. <laughs> I've done before. Yeah. Not hard. It's not hard? Yeah. Somebody said uh, Spencer Thaddeus Desai comment section. Oh, that's not good. Type yeah. TD. <laughs> All right, let's go to Jared. What up, Jared? Appreciate you. <laughs> Giants fan said I'm not the best. I appreciate your honesty. Cam Newton to the Steelers. Why or why not? I don't think it makes sense for Pittsburgh. I they believe in Mason Rudolph as they continue to not let him throw the football downfield. It's weird. And in theory, Big Ben's back next year, so then what do you do with Cam Newton? I think at that point, it, if, it maybe if if Big Ben was going to retire, it makes more sense, since apparently he's not going to. I think Pittsburgh says no, and they don't do it. Let's go to the next uh, question from Miguel. What up, Miguel? Um, Robbie Anderson to the Bills. Do you think the Jets would make a trade with – their division rival. I, I think NFL teams are too hesitant to trade within the division because, oh, we don't want to make the other team better. But here's the thing. If you're trading away a player to make a different team better, maybe you shouldn't be trading them away. And in reality, if the Bills make you the best offer, do it. If they offer a second-round pick and you're not getting anything better than a third, take that offer. 
yeah, the Bills are better. That's fine. You got to focus on your own team. You can't worry about what other teams are doing. You got to build your own team better. I think that's the play there. Let's go to this next uh, question. I love food, but don't like you. Who I believe has changed his YouTube uh, yeah. profile name. So the old name was I hate commercial, but I love chat sports. Which, Good. Hey, like it. I'm about it. That's a much better uh, <laughs> username there. All right, hang on. Mm. Should the Raiders trade for Giovanni Bernard? It's an interesting question because right now the Raiders are in the market to find a running back. However, I think they want a thumper. Yeah, I think the issue here is that Gio Bernard, who I like, is just a, a rich man's version of Jalen Richard and DeAndre Washington. How much do you want to pay to upgrade over those two? That's they, the problem. But they did just work out CJ Anderson, LeGarrette Blunt, and Bo Time Scarborough. is a flat circle. Let's go to Logan Earp. Trent Williams to the Jags. Remember to use hashtag trades in the comments section. Right now we got 561 people watching on YouTube. Let's get to 500 Split. likes and Tom's going to flash us. Okay. Uh, you, can see my gross, okay? You, you can see my gross dad bod that no one wants to see. Uh, the, issue for Jacks, the, the issue for Jacksonville is they have the assets now because of the trade. I don't think that is the way they want to go. They've invested premium picks in camera. Robinson out of Alabama and Juwan Taylor out of Florida to be their left and right tackles, respectively. Maybe you could move Taylor inside to guard or Cam to guard, but I think it makes more sense to let those guys develop, save your draft picks, and continue to build that way. Let's go to my man, Brandon Dreamweaver. Could the Ravens trade for Vaughn Miller? Could they? Sure. I think it'd be a great fit for Baltimore and for Vaughn Miller. I think that'd be a nice upgrade. For Baltimore, I think the Ravens are a team that be, might, might be aggressive enough. I don't really believe that Vaughn Miller's on the market. We'll see if I'm right or wrong there, but I think what's cost a it would be very expensive for Denver to trade away Vaughn Miller. And if you're that front office and coaching staff, you believe that hey, maybe you're only one off season away. At that point, you don't trade Vaughn Miller because he's still under contract. Who wants a shout out? I want you. If you want a shout out, I want you to type. Bet DSI in the comment section because they're okay. sponsoring today's show. And if you guys love the NFL and you love betting on sports and you want to bet on heck college football as well, you got to go to chatsports.com slash bet. So if you want to shout out on today's show, type Bet DSI in the comment section. But let me tell you about Bet DSI, the Internet's number one sports book. If you put down $50, you're going to get $60 for free. Yeah, you put down $100, you get $120 for free. Put down $500, be a big baller. Get $600 for free. Bet the is the internet's number one sports book, and I challenge y'all to find a better deal out there. So, who's going to get some shout outs? We got Patrick, Ronan, Sarah Small, Ryan Contero, Cameron Thomas, David Gonzaga. I appreciate you. Make sure you guys get started with our sponsor, Bet the Let's go to William Parker. Remember Willie Parker running back for the Steelers? Fast Willie Parker. Could have been him. I don't know. Get a picture. Josh Gordon and pick for OJ Howard. I don't know why the Bucks would do that. They already have Mike Evans and, and Chris Godwin. Why would they bring in Josh Gordon? I, I know Patriots fans want OJ Howard. I understand That'd that. That'd be a high-flying offense. It, it, yeah, but... <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. I, I just... I don't foresee the Bucks making that move. And although you can technically trade players off of IR, I don't see that happening with, with this particular scenario for Josh Gordon. Now, guys, remember to use hashtag trades. If we missed any of your questions whatsoever, you can hit me up at MitchellRens365 or at WhatGoingDowny. Remember to click that like button and subscribe to YouTube.com slash TV.